Okay. Yeah. Love that. Roll. Okay. Hi guys. So I'm going to be showing you how to transplant plants. Uh, so whether you're just transplanting plants from around your house, from one pot to another, or you're in the wild and you see something that looks good, or you're just coming to the gardens and you take some of our mint, uh, this is very useful. So first things first, you're going to want to choose the right kind of container to transport your plants. Uh, I would recommend one of these because these can hold so soil, which will help the plant not become as dehydrated during transport. Um, you can also use one of these uh, plastic containers and put some moisture in so that the plant dehydrates less. Uh, and you can also use one of these plastic bags that you usually get from takeout or something else. And also use some paper towels that are moist to cover the plant that you're transplanting. Um, also keep in mind that the size of the plant you're going to transplant is also going to affect the container you're going to take. Because like, for example, if you're taking a zucchini plant and you're trying to transplant it with one of these, that's not going to work. Um, side note here, if you're transplanting with one of these, there's a very specific technique you're going to want to use while transplanting and digging up the plant. Uh, you're going to take one of these small shovels, put it in the ground, put your hand here and push it down and then go left to uproot it to try to avoid root damage because plants that get root damage um, don't live as healthily as plants that don't have root damage. Uh, and then you're just going to put it in the pot here and then you're going to water it. And if the plant goes up, you're going to want to push it down again just because uh, it's going to be less stable and also it's going to erode if you don't. So, yeah. Uh, also, choose your plants wisely, the ones that you're going to transplant, because if you take plants that have, for example, pest damage, or they're very dehydrated, or they look like they're about to die, they're probably going to die when you transplant them. And that's because of something called transplant shock, which is caused by the roots of the plant that you're taking out they're not as evenly going to be evenly dispersed when you're going to plant them back in the soil, which means that they're going to become dehydrated and droopy. Uh, so to, to remedy to this, you're going to want to transplant your plants somewhere that has shade and also somewhere where, and also to try to like water it as soon as you plant it in the ground. Uh, otherwise, just have fun transplanting whatever you want and uh, I'll see you at the gardens.